When you think of a high-fat diet, it's not just about eating a lot of hamburgers. In fact, the popular ketogenic or keto diet is high on fat. I eat a lot of eggs. And it's possible that diet may help fight off infection for humans. It was kind of an on and off switch, and we were blown away. Portland State University researcher Brooke Napier led an earlier study that showed mice fed a high-fat keto diet saw a significant impact on their immune systems. Meaning that they had worse inflammatory disease, but uh, they were clearing infection faster. Then Napier, who is an assistant professor of biology, took the next step. She and her team worked to figure out which specific saturated fat was responsible for the dramatic change in the immune systems of the test mice. They found it was palmitic acid, the most common saturated fat found in the human body and that it could actually alter stem cells to fight off infection. But again, it can also be very bad for someone at risk of sepsis, the number 11 killer worldwide. So it is this double-edged sword where it can exacerbate an inflammatory disease, but it's actually great in the context of something like an infection, which is pertinent, you know, relative to a global pandemic. More research brought some good news. Another type of fat found in things like olive oil and avocados counteracted the inflammatory effect of palmitic acid. So it really isn't that one fat is bad and the other fat is good. It's that we're trying to figure out the ratios that are the best suited for these diseases. Next steps may be checking the same things in human studies to see how a balance of fat helps us or hurts us. Tim Gordon, KGW News.